Nigerian citizen detained in Saudi Arabia prison for months over expired visa cried out for help. Hello everyone, welcome to Marigoldi TV. Please, if today is your first time to watch or listen to my updates, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also remember to press the bell sign. For those of you now, we are done ready to subscribe and to all my returning subscribers, thank you so much. I really appreciate each and every one of you all. If you never see subscribe, I beg, kindly do so because in this channel, I do bring latest updates, current news, Bunge Mata, as it just said, the Shelley. So, my country people, this very update where I carry console, he get to do with uh, Nigerians, okay? Some of our Nigerians citizens, we are there for Saudi Arabia prison. Due to the old narration, we're not going to see here for this very video. This uh, Nigerians citizen, they don't cry, come out for help or saying they want to return back home because they have been long in. Saudi Arabia prison because of say their visa where they take travel go there it don't expire. On oh, no, no, now this uh, abroad way we hold day. Uh -huh. If you travel, enter this abroad with visa. If you get luck, they renew it for you. Okay, you go see stay. If you not come get luck, they feel just refuse you not to renew the visa. Once they don't refuse like that and you not seek asylum. What it go happen? You just have to return back to the country away from the call. So be like saying that be the case of those guys. Probably some de some of those guys they go there, maybe as a student, or some say go there to work, or one or two other reasons make them enter there and at the end of the day, the visa can expire and it they not come renew for them. So as they not come renew for them. Now they come begin come they catch all of them one by one or they come say okay since we are not one great command for that country voluntarily so what did they go do now for them to live now to get freedom to the waka for inside Saudi Arabia there is no way so now they come carry all of them as they catch them they go they put them for inside Kirikiri. The many oh now see this thing when they look here so we be like saying a plastic now human being now they inside now rubber bag. Now those guys can't say they cover themselves like say now do they then you stay cover up. They can't look now and say ha what I don't pass Gary oh they don't to take there and the place where they day max two weeks three weeks now they're supposed to stay rich. They say other people will be say they see carry other country people where they see carry see come put there. Their government don't help them come out. they don't return them back to their country. We can't remain only them will be Nigeria citizen. Now I see they for inside the Kiri Kiri one at the sea. So for the past how many months? So not be the guys' eyes. They can't say cry, come out now, say, make Nigerian government come to their rescue. Say make they come remove them, return back, uh, return them back to Nigeria. So as I come across this very video, I really feel sorry for those guys. It's not really easy. It's not really easy. Waiting Nigerian cities is due to the bad government of our country. We have been say that they make Nigerian cities to just get tired of that country. You go there for Nigeria to find work in Wahala, to live a comfortable lifestyle. You go there hard. You just have to keep struggling. You go see come out for that country. Say, okay, you want to enter another man country maybe things go see better sometimes if you get luck things go see go well but sometimes you know go see for put the way where you take planner at the end of the day you come begin call the calculate say it did better for you to return back to your country but if you want to come return now you know go see get money to go sit and buy ticket they'll come see carry you now put you for kiri kiri eh the nigerian government go even see and say ah there are cities they suffer for wherever they they home and abroad they don't go say may they do something we go see make the cities not to they travel out of the country anyhow nigeria are good now they make so many nigeria cities they travel it's not really they good now the rich ones they enjoy around the poor ones the average ones they're just struggling why the ones will never get any other alternative, they go try to make their way to leave that country to enter this uh, Western world. Yet, as they go see reach this Western part of the world, things not go see they easy for them. Look at those Nigeria guys. 
not being told, Una go see say those guys they are just suffering. So I beg my country people, make uh, this uh, video. We just hope that it gets to the Nigerian government hand. Make them go rescue all those guys come up for Saudi Arabia. It's getting tough for them. It's getting tough. Ah, now wow. So my country people, I just want to make una just watch this very video. Make una see waiting lots of Nigeria citizens. They go through all because of the bad leaders where we get for our country. Ah, I just hope that one day all those Nigerian leaders they go realize what thing that they do to their citizen. Watch this very video now, my people. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My fellow elective leaders, uh, I'm wishing you the best of luck and uh, a bunch of greetings and uh, gratitude. I'm here to forward this uh, video to you on net. Obviously, the reason for doing so is based on the one condition that we are here in Saudi Arabia. We all here, we are Nigerian candidates. So we are here more than three months, six months, seven months ago without any action and no any better, better information, best information based on transportation back to Nigeria. And actually, the According to the rules of rules of rules and regulation of uh, this location, is you will be here for at least two weeks. But we are here more than five months, six months, seven months without any uh, without any information. So and you know, most of the countries has has flight back to their countries. Only we Nigerians we don't have any source or any way of getting back. So please and please, I'm here on behalf of the others to seek for your pardon, to help us please and assist us. Assist us please to get us back to our country, inshallah. This is the only reason why we seek for your own pardon. So my people, now don't hear what those guys they go through for the end of Saudi Arabia government. This one a very big shame to Nigerian leaders, honestly. Nigerian cities go see there for Nigeria. Make una see help them. go see the hard. The ones who still make their way out to see come out for that country to say okay, they want go look for greener pasture. They want go look for better life. If it better, they go see happy. Anyhow, anyhow it be, they not mind so far may they leave that Nigeria. But at the end of the day, the country where they plan to go, if things not come work out for them well, the whole thing go just kind of come dead tired. For all those guys, ah, why now? Why these uh, Nigerian leaders? They just said they are so to the devil. This one are pure wickedness. You know, be said they know they see waiting so many Nigerian cities that they go through for them to use and take great job opportunity for that our country because there are so much things that we all see for this social media where many of uh, Nigerian cities that they go through for this abroad here. Yeah. That one alone, the bad government, they're not going to say they're not, they see him. That's supposed to even kind of encourage them more. Say, no, the kind of suffer, the kind of struggle where their cities they go through for this uh, abroad. Wherever any Nigerian cities they may they just sit down, think of how they go take great enough job opportunity so that uh, so many of the cities they're not going to travel hard just like that. If you want to travel out as a citizen, it will be based on your own choice. Not be say based on say work, not day. Based on say there is no way for you to take survive for that country. Not go be based on that again. It could just be based on your own choice. No, this will not be wickedness. I just hope at the end of the day, my people, make all those guys, make the government see the video and rescue them out. It's not easy. Those guys are going through a lot. They are going through a lot. So my country people, as I come across this very update, now I say make I bring and come for now, make una see the kind struggle, eh, suffer with some Nigerians, they suffer for Saudi Arabia. You know, he's a... Anyway, my people, thank you very much. Don't forget, subscribe to this channel, press the bell sign, 
drop your comment and see you in my next update